Hello everybody, it's Lauren from It's The Kellys, and today I have another Monos review for you, and I'm so excited to show you this bag. It is the Monos Carry-On Pro. Now, when I went to the Monos pop-up store in Toronto a couple of months ago, I was so excited to look at the Pro bag, and mainly because I wasn't really super interested in it, but you guys were. And you said, Lauren, please show me the pro bag. I want to see the pocket. I want to see the inside. I want to see how much depth it takes out. And I got to play with it a little bit at the store. I got to show you guys in that video. But then ever since then, I've had a good relationship with Monos. I am now a Monos brand ambassador, which means I get a discount code for you guys when you want to purchase items and I get sent items to review so that you can fall in love with them. When Mono said, what do you want to review next? I named off a couple of things, but the number one thing I named off was the Monos Carry-On Pro because I can't wait to do a more thorough, extensive review for you guys today and show you what fits inside of it. If you aren't subscribed to this channel, please do so by clicking down below. I am your girl for all things travel and packing, especially luggage reviews. And I travel often and pack well, and I just wanna help you do the same. Before we get started, if you are interested in getting anything from Monos, whether it be a suitcase, whether it be a backpack or a duffel, my discount code is linked down below all right let's check out this bag i'm so excited to show it to you now i got olive green because green is my favorite color i think the color is just so pretty and rich and it honestly too a woman can wear it for sure, but this can be a nice kind of manly color too. It does come in eight colors that are always available, and then there are two colors that are limited edition that you can get this in as well. There are two different sizes. This is the regular carry-on, which is a little bit smaller, and then there is the carry-on Pro Plus, which is just a little bit bigger. I've talked about mono sizing before. This normal carry-on size is absolutely perfect for stingy international airlines where they want your luggage to be smaller and then the plus size with monos is a little bit better for maybe some domestic travel within the US and I don't want you to have to get forced to check your bag because that's not very fun it does not come in a checked version because if you're going to use this pocket for things like your laptop and electronics and a really easy quick grab, you're not gonna wanna check those items, you're gonna wanna carry it on. This version right here, like I said, is the carry-on, and it is listed on the website as $311, but then that's crossed out and it says $295. So at the time of filming, it's $295. It's a little bit more than the regular carry-on, but it does have this outer shell pocket which is a feature and that's why it's a little bit more. So on the website, this bag says that it is 22 by 14 by nine, but you guys know that I love to do measurements in person because sometimes they can be a little bit off. So let's go ahead and get that out of the way because I know that that's what a lot of you guys come to this channel for. So the height, and this is gonna include the wheels and the handle, is, yeah, just under 22. Like, the wheels and the actual top is 21.5, then you add the handle, and I guess it could be 22, but I would have it go as 21.5. The depth of it with the pocket is actually nine, so that's good. And then, I'll measure it from the back here, but the width, honestly, just about 13 and a half. And then I know weight isn't as important when it comes to carry-on luggage, but some airlines do weigh your luggage and weight is important. So this weighs 7.8 pounds. So it weighs just a teeny bit more than the regular carry-on, probably because of the pocket, but it's still pretty lightweight when compared to other luggage brands that are Monos competitors. And then this bag can hold 36 liters 
worth of stuff. So this one has all of the same great features that Monos has in their bags, but then this is the outer pocket, and this is what I really wanna focus on. I'm still gonna show you the inside in case you're new to my reviews or in case you're new to Monos luggage because I want you to be able to see it to make a decision. But what I'm really here for today is the front pocket. Now I've made a video before that said pet peeves about luggage that I can't stand, and I mentioned outer pockets. And I still don't quite know how I feel about them. The whole reason I usually don't like outer pockets is because these inches here and these inches here, typically if you open up a suitcase, they are completely even. I've reviewed some luggage before where the outside pocket actually took away from the depth of one of the sides and therefore you really couldn't pack that much stuff and I didn't like that and I ended up returning it and then this channel became a luggage review channel kind of because of that review. You guys are interested in this because of the pocket. I'm interested in this because of the pocket. So let's open up and check it out. So it does have these two zippers here. And it is a little bit hard to open because it is indented and grooved in and it comes out this far which is nice have a compartment for a laptop that is mesh it goes all the way down and you have another little slit pocket here and then when we open it up and put it over here this is kind of a little half pocket there you have one zippered mesh padded container here and then you have two other ones down below and then you've just got the whole bottom depth for whatever you want. So now let's go ahead and pack it with some stuff and see exactly what it can hold and still close. Let's go ahead and put my laptop in. And then we're gonna go ahead and put my phone in one of these pockets here. And then let's throw in an iPad as well. So we're gonna slip that in this other little pocket here. And then I have my phone. I could totally fill it up with some pens and other stuff, but let's just use the big electronics just to test it out. So, close it, zip it, and we're good. Now as for all of the other features from Monos that I know and love, let's show those real quick. Of course you do have TSA locks right here. That is how you can open the suitcase if you want to lock it. There is a handle here and a handle here for an easy quick grab. And then of course there is a handle that has multiple heights and the button is on the bottom to be more ergonomic with your hand and it just goes up and down and it's just really, really, really nice and smooth even when it's fully packed. When I roll Monos luggage through the airport, you guys, you can't even hear me coming. It is so silent, it is so smooth. They're going to be great whether you're on carpet, whether you're on pavement, whether you're on cobblestone, or whether you're in the airport. One thing I'm noticing real quick while these TSA locks are staring me in the face is that there isn't a lock for the pro part. Um, I've seen some pro bags that do have TSA locks for this as well. They do have a little hole right there on the zippers that you can always attach your own lock. So let's go ahead and open it up by doing that and we're gonna check out the inside. It is the same great inside as all the other Monos luggage, which to be perfectly honest, is my favorite, favorite, favorite features. This is the best inside of a bag that I've probably ever used. Okay, so this is the inside here. This here is the zippered side and this here is the compression side. And the compression side is what I'm talking about when I talk about how absolutely impressive and amazing the inside of Monos bags are. But when I tell you this bag compresses down so much, all of you overpackers out there, Monos is for you. Because these compression straps 
bring everything down so small that you could probably pack an extra four inches worth of stuff and still compress it down. So anyway, you have the compression right here. You have this extra little bag right here. And then over on this side, this is zippered and contained. So it's nice if you're putting a bunch of loose items in there. So it does have a zipper with a mesh compartment. And then of course, zipper it up and it has goodies in there. Let's check out the goodies. Every Monos bag comes with two shoe bags. It also comes with a laundry bag and then it does come with a luggage tag right here. And then of course it has a little magic eraser in case there's any scuffs, which Monos I don't usually have to deal with because it's pretty indestructible. And then of course it comes with directions on how to set your TSA lock. Now let's go ahead and talk about this part here because when you open this up, this is the side that has the pocket. And what I really wanna make sure today is that it doesn't take out too much depth of this side. On the compression side, all the way up to the zipper, you do have four and a half inches. And then, I don't know if you guys can tell, but here where the actual pocket is on the outside, it doesn't hit the whole entire thing. So you can kind of see that there's a little groove right here where that pocket is. So there's this depth where the pocket is, and then there's this depth in here that is the true depth. So you could honestly kind of Tetris pack is what I like to call it, and really kind of stick some items in there and then have everything else kind of normal where the depth might be lost a little bit. So measuring the real true depth is four inches. And then the depth where the pocket is, is about three and a quarter. So it doesn't even take up a whole inch, which is very nice. When I check the depth on suitcases on this channel, I take one of my husband's size 13 shoe and put it in here to see if I can still pack a shoe and if it is indeed deep enough. Let's see how it fits on this side and if I can still zip it with the shoe in it because it does go a little high and then that's definitely too high so well, let's see if I can do it if I can't it doesn't mean it's you know bad it's just yeah I was able to zip it all right, I, I didn't think I was gonna be able to zip it. It passes my test. I'd say I'm pretty impressed with this bag. If you want to get this bag or any other beautiful, incredible Monos bag, please go to the description box down below and there will be a link and a discount code so that you can get a Monos bag delivered to your home and use it for your next trip. Please let me know down in the comments if you're interested in anything Monos at all. I'd love to know what you get. I'd love to know what color you get. And I'd love to answer any other questions for you. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate all of your views, likes, and comments. And of course, if you press that subscribe button, if you want to see anything else from Monos from me, please comment down below and I really take it into consideration and can get it and review it for you. I will see you guys later. Thank you. Bye.